In this week in military history, we explore the plot to kill the Führer of Germany, Adolf Hitler. Although the July plot of 1944 with Klaus von Stauffenberg, made famous in the Tom Cruise film Valkyrie, is perhaps the best known German attempt to kill Hitler, it was actually one of many. In early March 1943, German army officers fearing Germany's downfall and losing faith in Hitler's leadership and in both the course and the conduct of the war set out to remove Hitler from power. Major General Henning von Tresco, a member of General Fedor von Bock's Army Group Center stationed on the Eastern Front, led the conspiracy to kill Hitler. Von Tresco had previously plotted to arrest Hitler in the summer of 41, but was unable to get close enough due to Hitler's SS bodyguards. In a plot called Operation Flash, Tresco tried again on March 13, 1943, with Lieutenant Fabian von Schlabrendorf. Hitler was scheduled to fly from Vinitsa in the Soviet Union to Rastenburg in East Prussia with a stopover in Smolensk. During the stopover, a parcel bomb was to be given to the Fuhrer under the guise of it being a gift of liquor for senior officers in Rastenburg. The bomb was intended to explode while over Minsk and the conspirators would take control of the central government upon hearing the code word flash. Things, however, did not go as planned. The fuse was defective and the parcel bomb did not explode. Undeterred by this setback, Tresco and his conspirators plotted a new attempt for March 21st, 1943, on Heroes Memorial Day, which honored Germany's World War I dead. Tresco would be involved in the later July plot also, ultimately committing suicide when it failed. Von Schlebrandorf too was involved in the later plot, but survived arrest and torture, ultimately becoming a judge in West Germany. Join us next time for another segment of This Week in Military History with the Pritzker Military Museum and Library.